Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my video. Going, going, God, boss, what? Boss, what? Going, going, God. Now remember, people, that was Yahoo, me and stay away, if I want a D figure entertainment like always. All right, now I'm going to talk about some healing. Now, yesterday I was on Jamaica Avenue, and you know, the pellet shot, that's something that the people, them, or the police, they use to, to like, cut down the people, them, or cut the people, you know, dancing. No, so, I was on the, the avenue, and then I went on the subway, and after I went on the subway, I noticed my feet started to feel a different way. But there's only one person, I was talking, and he stooped down, and I'm size lace, but I have my back turned like that, looking on the sheriff to pick up something. And after I walk out of the store, like about five minutes earlier, five minutes after that, I noticed that my feet start to feel a little bit different. Now, so by the time I go to um to on the F train, I notice that I if I don't come out for the F train and try to get um something to heal my feet, yo, I won't be walking. You understand? So like about that two hours after I noticed my feet start to shake down. You understand? And people doing things to delay to let to delay me to, to reach back with this home right here. This is my mother. Now, but as a quick thinker, this right here, the alley, allergy, I pop one of them. Alright, understand? And then I go into the the uh the hot water and heat it in there. But when I was heating my feet within the hot water, I noticed like slime coming out of my leg. You know, like from the whole uh, one side of my feet, like from right from the ankle part, like from this end, it was it's it sees up. I couldn't even move my toe. You no, know? so I know what it is. It's pellet shop. Uh, when I used to be at the shelter, I see they do it to a lot of the people that inside it, and they just don't walk and they just lose their feet. So most of these people that you see in the street without no feet, yo, is pe is the police they do it or people do it to them. And I think the pellet shot is no joke, man. This is why some of us wear um book bag on our back as if you hit in our back and it's probably go cripple or come down with cancer. You understand? So because of I past experience with that when I used to do recycle, I noticed, you know, how, what, what to cure it and I come from West Smaller. So with my quick thinking, I mix up um aloe vera and um and and, and uh cinnamon uh, honey and tie it on my leg but when i do that i know the pain gets more severe so i have to take it off you understand i have to take it off because i don't know what was bothering it because after i put it into the um the hot water and took it back out i noticed a little bit different i could able to move my toe but I, it was paining me like a severe pain like i ready to call 911 but with my quick thinking after i did the mix the um the cinnamon and the honey it looked like this like that this is what i've been putting over my eye also to, to not go blind you understand because sometimes if i'm sleeping you know even really, down to your own family do that thing you understand you now so in this now video i'm gonna show you now you see this is the garlic this is garlic right here is some garlic that's garlic right there but i tied on on my leg from last night but when i wake up i notice the color of the garlic change color of the garlic change completely no so what was inside of my leg i noticed it go inside of the garlic but i've been using the garlic and uh, um and the ginger from about three to four years doing that because they do it to me more than one time you understand and i couldn't move my leg but when i tie on the garlic and the ginger and it instantly it uh it, it, it um it, it kill it kill it it kill uh, um the disease inside the leg and it's supposed to shut down the leg while I was here last night, I hear a person pass and say, your, your leg was supposed to cut off. You understand? Because I couldn't move my leg. So now when I wake up this morning, you know, I apply cinnamon and honey to it. Like, right, this is my leg right here. You see that? Look at my leg, right? Here. See that where I put the cinnamon and honey right there? Last night, I couldn't do that. I couldn't do that with my leg. It, was, it, it seized. It, it, it shut down the whole, the whole feet, like right here. You understand? So... The hot water, it works. You have to dip it in hot water and be on it, man. Yeah, when when you uh you walk, you can't feel it. You understand? Know when I say you can't feel it, you can't feel your leg. You gone. Then they step on you, just pain. You know, I start to curse out everybody last night, man, because I know it's the police that does it. 
Is the police the one them who giving you ears jam and um, cancer in your back and, and crippled people? You understand? Now, this pill right here is good to have one and good to take a tiny. Believe me, man. But you have to notice it. This is what's wrong with the society, man. When when some things that occur on them, they are not like um, uh, um, um, visualizing or, or, or ready or doing quick thinking on, on the pain. You know, the moment you start to feel something you don't feel before, man, call 911, or if you know remedy, you you you, you hop on that. But me now, I'm a, I'm a country person from the island, so most of these things that I tell you, I, I, I apply it to my leg. So when I apply it to my leg now this morning, I was able to, to move my toes. It shut down the toe completely. So if you was a Rasta man, I always remember the honey and the Cine man, a Tynal, Benadryl, or the Ali to, to shut down the pain. You have to fight it fast. And the Cine man and the honey, when he makes it look like that, I show you that already. And remember the garlic. And if you go and if you go heal it, don't lose no clock. If you're going to tie on this overnight, you have to tie on the garlic, raw garlic. But the two different types of garlic. You got, you got a, a garlic that um that, that uh, have a little bit of acid into it. And you got one with more acid. Because I'm about to go to the store after I've done this video and go, go and get the acid one. Because when you put the acid one on it, there's it a two different garlic. You got no study. He has one more one more shinky and one more, more powerful. So you have one with more acid. If you if you use this plastic and tie on the one with the acid, what will happen? A boil gonna pop up on your leg. Whatever in your leg, the the, 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 the stronger one will pull it up. If you put um, ginger on it and tie it with the plastic like this, it will soak it up. But there's gonna be a sore on your leg. But what gonna happen? The bacteria in the leg, like if they hit you like right here, because uh, they hit me like right here, and the pain used to be right here, it's no more here. It moved to right here now. But it, it I could do that. No, that's a good part. I couldn't do that. Understand? But you have to use plastic. Don't use no cloth. Because the heat, I think that that disease to the leg, it uh, um it, if you're tied down with cloth, it makes the pain more, more worse, man. And do not put no 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 if you're from the parish, don't put no oil on it and nothing like that. Man. First thing you wanna do with that, put some hot water. You understand? Put hot water on it. And I could recommend if you do not have hot water, you'll get a plastic bag with some with two like tie two two plastic bags together. You understand? Like two of these plastic bags, just tie them, put some water in them, and fold it up like that, and put it on your leg for now. But remember, man, always take a Advil and take a Benadryl and or a Aleve or one of them to help cure to to, to fight the pain. Because all of these together not gonna fight it, man. Because if you don't do that, you're gonna lose your leg. And if you go to the doctor. That's going to tell you to cut it off. That's the end of the video, man. I got to do that to everyone around the world. So all those wonderful people in, the, in, in, in around the world, yeah, it wasn't disease you come down with, man. Somebody shoot you with a pellet shot. You understand? And give you the disease, man. You understand? And it will shut down your leg and shut down your whole body. You understand? So remember the cinnamon and honey? Remember? Take one of that. And the you know, man, honey, I do that already. And remember the great garlic. And you could mix this garlic with Alice Alice and do that to your feet. But I recommend before you do that, put it in hot water and do that because sometimes I saw the police they do it to slow down society. And if you were a dancer, you know the dancers they came down with that with leg problem all the time. And they put it in our little cast, man. The moment you feel it, man, attack it. Take a pillar, get some hot water and heat it in it, man. It's gonna, it gonna painful when you heat it. When they were in the hot water, but make it heat, and then you will notice your the the, the slime in it start to run out, and you take your hand and rub it away. But take a cloth and do it, because if you spread it, you gonna go down into your leg. Yeah, one more time. I tell you, say if you put it in the hot water, you go you go notice the 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 slime in it or whatever in it coming out. So when when you put it in the hot water for five to ten minutes, pull it out, take a rag and wipe it off, because the slime spreading, it might spread down into your back or your feet and all sort of damage. You understand? So always remember to Yahoo me, S T A Y F I Y A B F G Entertainment. Remember Google me the same thing. Remember Bing me. Remember um, Yahoo, Bing, YouTube me, and Twitter me, and Facebook me, and, and put me on your sharing mind. 
or share the videos them. I make them long, right? But it's just a healing video.